Man, you know we boys. You know, man, if you ever need me for anything, you can call me. You know that. Sure. I'm telling you, look, I, look I, I don't know who else you could depend on to magically end up in Chicago from Georgia on a random weekend. For, yeah, I, I, I don't know who else you know could do something like that for you now. <laughs> and look, you didn't even know I was coming. <laughs> I said, I told him, I said, you want to know what's crazy? He said, what? I said, we coming up there to see my uncle, so I probably can make it. Look, man, you you look, you got me on, you got me out of out of Georgia to play some baseball. Well, let me say out the south, you got me out the south to play some baseball. My name is G.K. Hunter. I am from Augusta, Georgia, and I went to high school at Lucy C. Lane High School. I played for Coach Maiden in the summer of 2015. Uh, I met Coach Maiden at my high school baseball field. It was it was very interesting. I went to to the field. I want to say that morning. They just work out and get some extra work in. And uh, I guess him and my high school coach had organized the workout that day. And I ended up being a part of the workout. Playing for Coach May, you know, I, it was uh, one of my best baseball experiences. Um, I got out of my hometown. I got out of my home state. And um, I went up north. And I did a lot of traveling playing for him. And um, it was a – at the time, it was a confidence booster. Because I got to play against, you know, people outside of my area. And I got to see how I went toe-to-toe with other guys and see what the people from up north play baseball like. Uh, the team and my teammates. Um, I love the team. I love my teammates. Um, I love the coaches. Everything um, the everything was swift uh, from the first day when we had a – I want to say it was like a scrimmage-type game, but it was like an opening game to get everybody comfortable. From that day to the last game I played, everything was good. I enjoyed every last bit of it. Teammates was good. I got some favorite teammates, but I ain't going to name them. Coach May is my favorite coach. That is true. <laughs> <laughs> um, my most memorable experiences don't come from the baseball field, Coach. They come from the um the van trips and the bus trips. Um, It wasn't really st- – stuff away from the field, like like – pre-game and post-game stuff. And um, I pro- I don't really have a favorite because I think of a lot of stuff, but I don't really got a favorite one. They all, like, unique in their own way. Here were some of those stories. Um, he, like, he, like, the joke with me when he called me, he'd be like, uh, he, he didn't call, he didn't, he didn't call me G. Coach Maiden didn't call me GK. Coach, you called me, you called me G or G-Man. And then, because we had a, um, had another kid on our team named we called named Guan. He called Guan G. You called Guan G. And then you called me G Man. And you was like, hey G Man. I was like, what you want, coach? He was like, hey G Man. <laughs> Over there calling him like like he my number one fan or something. Um uh, another memory I got, this one, this one came from on the field. I had a I had no hitter going. And um uh, you ain't you know you ain't yell from the dugout, but he was talking from the dugout. I was trying to throw the kid a curveball, and he was like, man, stop throwing that. So I threw him a fastball. He got a hit, and then I come in the dugout, and you say, you had a no hit, and I say, oh, I know. I know, coach. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, man. Um, bus trips, the van trips, we was, man, funny. Uh, joking around with each other, cracking. Like, it was mainly, like, fun and jokes. Um, I want to say being in um in Chicago – the weather was a little different than being down south. And um, the weather in Chicago was like 80, 85. Um, when I was in practice one day, one of my teammates was like, man, it's hot outside. I was like, hot. He was like, yeah. I said, man, this feels good. I was like, wait till we end up down south. Wait, wait till we like pass through Georgia, go to Florida or something. And then um, we stopped by a gas station in Georgia, hop off the bus. It's like 95, 98. They like, man, bro, you got it down here, bro. I, ain't, I don't even want to be down here no more. Like, you was right. It's hot. If you're good where we at, uh, I could have seen you coaching for 50. <laughs> I, I don't know why you stopped at 40. I, I want to see you do another 10. I think about it. But um, that's, that's uh, it, don't, it don't really surprise me too much. I, I can see you coaching for 40 with no problem. Yeah, he can. Coach May can definitely be a character. But I mean, it ain't nothing bad though. Um, he like you know. Sometimes it's normal coach stuff, and it's just sometimes it's him being being himself. 
some of the memories uh really I want to say bringing my my um my skill set from home up there and then you know it it still being impressive it um me still standing out and not really being like a fit in um it was uh, one game I can't remember the city it was in it wasn't too far from Chicago though um my umpire asked me he was like where you from cuz um you know he could tell I wasn't from around the area I told him I was from Augusta, Georgia. He was like, whoa. He was like, man, you a long way from home, man. I told him, yeah. And he was like, man, you a good ball player. Uh, got in a few. Um, everything wasn't always um, peaches and cream when it came to me and you. Uh, not knowing too many arguments, more like, you know, debates or one seeing eye to eye. But um, it was all love. I was um, – I kept trying to swing for the fence and – you was telling me I can't be trying to swing for the fence in a two strike count. Um, hit my first home run for you. That was my first home run ever. That was down in Florida. I never forget that. I still got the ball. Um, if it ain't take me five minutes to find it, I go get it. Uh, I will, um I end up coming home. Uh, I want to say a week, a week, a week or two early for school, and um I had got a I want to say a phone call, a video call, and I had um. I remember that you had gave me um you was giving out kind of awards pretty much for the summer. And I had um I had got the best hitter award for you. Uh what else? It's it's a whole bunch of stuff. Um when I first started pitching for you, you didn't pitch me um until like a couple of days or you know, I ain't touched the mind until a little bit into the summer. And um it went from uh me being G man to me being the ace. And then, uh, man, I that whole summer was, it was full of experiences I'll never forget. Like, I, I talk about them with other people to this day. Uh, still talk to them. Um, since since you asking, now I got a name. I, um, I talk to Guan every now and again. Uh, I don't really talk to um, Jalen too much, but I'll never forget Jalen. Oscar was my dog. Oscar, that's my boy. Oscar, my boy. Um and there's uh, other teammates and stuff. I I can't really remember names right now, but I I I, I remember not their names, but I remember the Um, nothing. I, uh, the only thing I changed is the next summer when I didn't come back. I, um, I'll probably make a return that summer. But everything that on that first summer was was good. I enjoyed all of it. You um when you was cooking the, the meals, you know what I'm saying. I, I kind of missed the meals a little bit too. Um, I probably um what I would say to Coach May, uh I probably never got the chance to tell him, but um I appreciate the experience. I appreciate everything um he did for me up there. Uh I do appreciate him coming down and um even making that stop at my high school and checking me out that time too. Um everything, you know, baseball wise, mentor wise, coach wise, all that stuff he did for me was out of love and I I enjoyed the experience with him, with the team, all of it. Cut, man. Hey, coach, man. When you when you perform, people want to know how you do what you do, man. Man, you know, he ain't got to think that. One. You know that one, huh? Look, I'm your boy. Huh? You you my boy, man. You know, if I ever end up um in Illinois in the area, I I I I make sure I make a stop to see. You You're probably gonna tell me I'm chunking now, but hey, yeah, well, I I can still hit a baseball. <laughs> yes, sir. Love you, coach.